uh, the Securities and Exchange Commission's latest decision wasn't enough to hold back the foremost uh, cryptocurrency, Bitcoin. Uh, the cryptocurrency crossed $38,000. Uh, even on the back of the SEC's move to delay two spot Bitcoin ETFs on November 28th, the SEC delayed its decision on Templeton and Hashtag's spot Bitcoin ETF application. As part of the announcement, the Commission also invited comments on what has been its major concern up till now, the issue of fraud and manipulation and whether or not the surveillance agreements in place can help curb that. Uh, uh, despite this development, the crypto market seemed unperturbed as Bitcoin crossed $38,000 and altcoins also posted some gains. This would come as a surprise to many considering that the latest momentum in the market has been attributed majorly to the possibility of the spot Bitcoin ETF approval. Uh, a plausible explanation could be the fact that investors are certain that approval is imminent, uh, irrespective uh, of the actions of the Commission. Uh, this is evident uh, in the fact that the institutional money keeps falling into the crypto market. Uh, CoinShare's latest report showed that uh, the crypto market last week uh, saw its uh, largest weekly inflow since uh, late 2020. And meanwhile, the SEC's latest delay is an interesting one, considering that a decision on both applications wasn't due until January 1st, 2024. This has led to several speculations as to whether or not this move still means that approval was on the horizon. What? Uh, but in a post shared on his ex formerly Twitter platform, Bloomberg analyst James Seifert uh, questioned the SEC's actions and what it could mean for a potential approval. Uh, he reasons that the SEC's uh, decision uh, could be uh, setting things up for a full wave of approvals uh, in early January. Uh, the analyst had previously put uh, the likelihood of an approval of January 2024 and 90 percent. And he further stated that the delay on HashX's application and HashX's announcement came shortly after Templeton's confirmed his reasoning. He believes that the SEC is moving to set up all applicants for potential approval by January 10th, 2024. He quickly noted that these approvals would be for the 19 b 4 and didn't necessarily mean an immediate launch. Uh, Scott Johnson, uh, a notable attorney for Davis Polk, also shared the same sentiments as CFART. He stated that the SEC might have chosen to delay these applications early, uh, saying that the comment period could end before uh, January 10th, 2024. Uh, that way they can approve all applications at the same time. Uh, 